Hi, this is Anil and welcome to the video tutorial for the learning lad on C++ programming. So in this tutorial, we're going to learn how to read an entire line in C++. So normally what we do is we use C in and read the input. For example, let's say you want to read a string value and you want to store that in this data object. So at that time, what we can do is we can uh, use C in and we used to write data and then we just output that all right now if i save this and build and run this program you know i just need to enter a string and let's say anil if i hit enter it returns properly and if i run it again and pass a line let's say i am the learning lad and hit enter you know it, it returns only i that's because you know this c in separates the input when it encounters a space or a new line or a tab you know the c in is gonna read i and then it encounters the space and it it thinks that okay that's the end of this string and that's why you know it returns only i but what we wanted is we wanted to read this entire line or this entire string so now you know before explaining you how to read an entire line i just want to copy these two statements you know the c in and the c out and paste it again and i just want to build and run this program and now let's enter a string let's say i am the learning lad and now you know you guys can see i am that's because you know this first c in reads i and then the space is there and uh, you know it only reads i and then the second c in statement reads am you know which is still present in the buffer and then it has a space and it only reads am so we get i from this first c out and then am from this second c out so because of the working of the c in in this way you know we can't read an entire line using the c in bar there is a alternative method so what we can do is we can use a function called get line so it's going to be get line and then first we need to specify from where we want to read a line we want to read from the input stream and from the c in object and then we need to specify where we want to store that readed line we want to store that in this data and that's it and then we, we are using this say out to print it out and now i'm gonna build and run this and we need to enter a string and let's enter i'm um, the learning lad and hit enter it returns i'm the learning lad and i just wanna run it again and i just gonna enter i am the learning lad and i am awesome and hit enter you know it reads the entire line so this is it guys this is how you guys can read an entire line using the get line function in c++ thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in the next tutorial